Yes, people, 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 come here, come here, people, come here. Queen B get this up today. Yeah, yo, Queen B get this up. Bad, 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 bad. Well, not really bad. No, I'm going to tell no lie on the man. The man never diss me up. You know, the man speak in mind and he say what he have to say. Because I did use the man video. And me use the man video because I wanted to show the difference between when you say somebody is bashing somebody compared to when somebody is just giving a constructive criticism. And every time I come on, I'm going to give me a little criticism or I'm going to tell me a little opinion about anybody me want to and choose to. But especially, yes, the D lady. Because like I said, I do hold her to a higher standard and she is more have an impression on the public more than anybody else. So therefore, I feel she need to conduct herself a certain way. She cannot be like everybody else on social media because she is in a different category. Like Spice said, different category mean a different category. Different, ca yeah, you know the song already, right? She's in a total different category. And I cannot take that away from her at all. And for me to say all of this, if anybody wants to say, oh, you did try to kiss up. Oh, you did try to get in at them camp. I'm in nobody's camp, honey. I am in Queen B camp, Queen B world. I am in nobody's camp. All right? All right. So if... Harry, yes, I'm going to call his name. Well, I shouldn't know. I need to make up a name for Harry. No, man, I'm not make up no name for Harry. His name is Wiz Harry, guys. Wiz Harry Studios. You guys could go follow him, like, and subscribe to his page if you want to hear that type of content. Because everybody has their own type of content, their own kind of platform, and everybody has a right to do so. This is America. We are free to talk about anything that we want to talk about and if he chooses to use his platform to voice his dislikes and likes and rage and whatever against anybody that he wants he has a right to do that right yes but again i use his video because i wanted to show even with the memories that he's playing the type of people that will diss our up bash our disrespect her, call her all kind of manner of names, and I do not do that. That is not me, that is not how I come across, and that is not the type of person that I am or try to be. So if everybody was coming up in my comment section, that video was for them. Not anybody that's coming up in his comment section or your comment section or any other blogger comment section. I did it for the people that comes in my comment section and continually to spread false narrative that I hate the D lady and that I be bashing her and I'm bad mind and this and that and all of that and that is the wrong narrative. Giving a constructive criticism or even an advice or giving my opinion does not equate to bashing, disrespecting, or dipping up underneath her. And that's why I put that video up for all who don't know the difference. So Harry, yes, I did use your video for that purpose to show them and to prove my point to them, not prove a point to you, not prove a point to anybody else, but to prove a point to my audience that don't know the difference between someone giving a constructive criticism or an opinion or somebody actually bashing and disrespecting her. So yes, I did use your video and you have all the right to be upset you have all right to come out at me and you have all right to do whatever you want to do. And if you want to come back at me again, feel free to do so. It is a free world. 
free speech. You're the one that I offended. I offended you. I did use your video. So if you want to come back at me, I have nothing to say about that. But touche. Because I'm not in any Facebook war with anybody. And people, I need you guys to take a lesson from this. If you don't take away anything else, I need you to take this away from the whole situation that just happened. If you know you are the one that is wrong, if you know you are the one that offended somebody, if you know you are the one that came out the wrong way and disrespect somebody, if they come back at you, you have to take it on the chin like a grown man and a grown woman. Don't try to come back and cuss them out and diss them out and uh, go with Ari and Ray Ray and go on up with yourself. No, you was wrong, you're wrong. Take your wrong. Take your wrong and move on. It's not the end of the world. There's nothing that anybody could say on social media that can define who you really are in a real person, in real life. You guys have got to learn to separate the two. Everything don't have to be a fight. Everything don't have to be an argument. You don't have to keep going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It, it, I mean, what are you resolving? What are you solving by going back and forth, back and forth to somebody that you may never meet in your life? You may never see. <laughs> you know what I mean? They don't know nothing about you. You don't know nothing about them. So therefore, anything they're going to say about you, whether in a derogatory way or not, is not going to really define who you are because they don't know nothing about you. So it's not the facts. It's not the facts, people. Stop getting so offended and getting all riled up and you try to come back at that person. That person try to come back at you and you just keep going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Queen B is not going to do that all right i'm going to take my wrong when i'm wrong and i'm going to stand for my right when i know i'm right in this situation i was wrong to use his video but i wasn't wrong to make the point that i was trying to make and i made that point point blank period so anybody that wants to be offended by what i did be offended be offended come out cuss me do whatever you need to do to get it out of your system if you feel that hurt that bothered and that offend offended because i'm not going to come back at you at all all right i respect your opinion i respect what you said again i'm not upset i'm not mad i see people already coming into my um comment section laughing hey, that's where your big old gray back woman that's where you get for run up your mouth and this and that and i'm like huh <laughs> it doesn't even bother me <laughs> like seriously <laughs> you know and those are the same people in comment sections that i tell you about and that i talk about you guys are the one that create the most problem and drama even the person that screenshot um the statement that I made in my community page and sent over to Harry. Those are the people who continue to cause these type of drama on social media. I talk about this in my video before. You have everybody from each camp that come in like they're the spy and the investigator and they're watching everybody page and they screenshot and them send it go get them boss and make them boss come out and cuss the person. And it just go on and 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 on. As you know how many times, guys, since I started my channel, you know how many times people have sent me things. Hey, look, so and so and so. You need to go talk about it. You need to go make a video about it. I am nobody's push button. Nobody push button. If somebody send me something, I say, hey, go watch this. I, 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 you need to do a video on it. Yes, I will go and go watch it. I'm not going to say I'm not going to go watch it. I am going to go and watch it. But if I watch it and I don't feel, you know, anything wrong with what the person said, or I don't feel anything wrong with what the person did, they just being their regular normal self. It was nothing irritating about it. There was nothing annoying about what they said. 
I leave it right where it's at. I leave it right where it's at. I am not going to make a video just because somebody say to make a video. I'm not going to do it. I am not going to do it. I am not nobody's push button. My platform was not built for people to speak their mind and have me do it for them or come out and bash somebody and argue with somebody just because they don't like the person. That will never, ever happen, not on my watch and not on my platform. And if every blogger will take that stance and stop coming out at people just because they got a screenshot of what somebody said or they got a video of what somebody said, yes, if you watch it and you see and you was truly offended by it I get it I understand you understand me you could come out at that point but don't watch it don't read the comment don't get the screenshot and you didn't really see anything wrong with it but just because somebody's there pushing your button to come out you come out and start to uh, and cuss up on you this and you no that is not me that is not me okay that is not me so People there in the comment section, oh, I'm done, you I'm this, I'm about right for done, you good for you, old gray back woman, good. <laughs> oh, Lord. All I did was just laugh, because you know what? You will not be able to get me riled up enough to come out here, grab my phone, and start to cuss back at Ari. I would never do that. Never. He has a right to say what he said. It was his video that I used, and the interpretation that he got from the video, he is partly correct. I did use it as a form of showing the difference between what I feel someone bashing and disrespecting someone compared to when I come out and I do a constructive criticism that's all the only reason why i put that video up and that's the reason why i also took it down because that is not what i'm trying to perpetrate on my channel that's not the type of messages or bashing or disrespecting of anybody that i put on my channel what i do i come out and i say my constructive criticism without any foul language, without disrespecting, without bashing, without dipping up underneath anybody because you could send your message out without doing all of that. So, Mr. Harry, no disrespect to you whatsoever. I respect what you do on your own platform because that is your platform, that is your content, and I did use it. All right, so you have a right to come out at me. So in saying that, that is all I came out here to say. And people, once again, don't go and trouble people. And when they come back at you, you want to come back on your life and call yourself cursing and disrespecting them. You cannot be wrong and strong. Learn to humble yourself. Admit you did wrong. Keep it moving. All right? All right. And Queen B, my non-stop chat. Anybody out there that I choose to talk about or they did something or say something or behave in a certain manner that I think is displeasing, I will be back out again. I will not be shut up. All right? All right. Anyway, guys, that's all I have to say. Have a good day, good afternoon, good evening, good morning, anywhere in the world you are today. And don't forget, subscribe, 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 and hit that notification bell, guys. How are you going to know that I post something if you don't hit the notification bell? Yeah. All right, guys. See ya.